How did it happen? Well, I got tackled end of the end of the third quarter. What'd you What'd you feel? A pop, crack, snap, crackle, pop. Or three rights, crispy man showed up too. It's not not the good kind. No, of. not the good kind. No. no. But yeah. You can. I mean, snap, crap, crackle, and pop. pop yep. Yeah. They're all, sounds, all three of them. That sounds concerning. Are you, are you concerned long term? No. No, not at all. Are you concerned week this week? Um, this week probably not. Um, but you know, take it day by day and just see how it goes. Probably not, as and you probably won't be able to play. Correct. Is it a pain thing, a range of motion thing, all of the above thing? Yes, all of the above. Okay. So, I mean, at, at the moment when you hear snap, crack, and pop, that would seem like it's, was there a great deal of concern at that moment that it was something, whatever was wrong with it, that maybe it's worse than Um I mean, there's always worry when there's not a full understanding, I guess, or diagnostic of what it is. Um, but knowing my body and everything, given that moment, I wasn't too stressed out or anything. I mean, I tried to play. So I knew obviously I could could bear through some of the pain and everything, but um, just as time kept going, it's just like it's probably not the best thing to. Do you have the full understanding of what it is now? Mm -hmm. so just you don't want to share that. No, I'll let them do that. This is just kind of the what's next moment for your room, if not for Sammy and Christian and you know and Randall and you and you got the young guys at the back. This is uh, a little more complicated than I think you would imagine. Yeah, yeah. I mean, definitely. Um, you could say things aren't going as planned this year um, from a <laughs> top to bottom uh, perspective and everything, but that's just the game of football and really life. So, um, you know, we're so, still, still stay positive. You know, even last week, um, obviously didn't get the results that we wanted and everything, but even going into that week, I'm, I was still very confident in our room and our ability as an offense. And truthfully, I still feel that same way. I think we're only really less than five plays away from really changing the game and flipping the momentum and, and really just instilling that confidence in us as an offense, but even more so as our team. And, you know, I think that's just the, um, that's the part that we're missing right now. Where's your level of confidence um, in the guys who are left over? I mean, obviously it's, it's you and Randall had all the chemistry, you know, heading into this thing. I have the utmost confidence in those guys. Um, you know, we've preached to them all year and even more so this week of that they're in this they're in this building for a reason and in the NFL for a reason. It's not by accident or anything. They they're very talented individuals and they're more than capable of going out there and, and showcasing that talent um, at the best of their ability. So I'm expecting um, big great things from those guys in those room and at the end of the day when you got twelve back there, um, you know, really anything's possible. So they just gotta go out there, execute do their jobs, not nothing more than that, and we'll just see where the where the ball lands. Christian said he was 100%. Do you feel, when you see him, do you feel like he's 100% ready to go? Yeah, I mean, that's more of a personal thing. I mean, you can sit here and look and evaluate people, but I think, as for us, like, truly you know your body the best and everything, and um, if he says that, then I believe it. And how much will having him back out there? It'd be huge, huge. Obviously, you know, he's he's extremely talented, hasn't really had um, the best year up to date so far with injuries and everything, kind of just feeling the offense and um, developing the chemistry with 12. But, you know, once again, it's still early, early in the season. There's still a lot, a lot ahead of us. You talked about how it's not been the best case scenario for the receiving Christian, Sammy missing so much time, Randall not being. Do you, you know your role. Do you guys need a trade for the receiver for this no. offense to be what it needs no. to be? No. Not at all.